lined eyes, lips painted a dark red and long Gender The state of being male or female But what if your gender does not conform to the conventional definition? Living in the shadows, shunned by society Sex can make about passive with chile, they pick up a party. It's easy to say they clap, they strip, they beg, they do sex work, they do badai. What the hell you have created for us? In April 2014, the Supreme Court passed a landmark judgment recognizing transgenders as the third gender, guaranteeing their right to equality, expression, autonomy and their right against all discrimination. The 14th I flew from Bombay to Delhi just to be there when the verdict is spoken. I could not sleep for the whole night because we didn't know what will the verdict come tomorrow. The verdict of the Supreme Court is the foundation laid on which directions we have to work in future. Transgender movement and the Hijra movement is the youngest civil rights movement in which got such a big success. Lakshmi Narayan Tripathi is one of the faces of the transgender community in India in the fight for their rights. One of the petitioners in the Supreme Court, her strongest attribute is her courage and self-belief. What mistake we have committed? We are only truthful that what we are, we are living our lives. And to accepting your own self, the torture one has to face is beyond imagination. But Lakshmi says her parents are the source of her strength. I had to prove myself to, to show to the world that my parents believed in me and accepted a transgender child. They didn't do anything wrong. But Lakshmi is an exception. Most transgenders are shunned, even humiliated by their own families. The family pressure to portray themselves as male while they feel like a woman from within often forces them to leave home. Just like Gauri, who left her family when she was just 17 with a hundred rupees in her pocket. She went through difficult times but never went back. One day, very strongly I took a decision that I won't stay with them. Without thinking, I just left my house. Within two hours, three hours, I realized it is not easy, Gauri. But I couldn't go back again. My door was closed. Still today, the doors are closed. One day, the incident was that I saw my daddy after 15 years walking on the street. And I was sitting in the rickshaw with one of my friends. And I just asked Vishal to wait. And then I asked my chela and say, Ki, Look, that man is my daddy. But I was not having gut to go and call him daddy. Being a something different, you are not ready to accept me. I have not spoiled anyone's life. I have not cheated any woman. You know, to keep this, you have to think that nature has given me this identity and what I am happy with what I am.
Gauri started work as an assistant in an NGO and today she runs her own NGO that works to prevent the spread of AIDS in her community. सबसे सुरक्षित हमें क्या इस्तेमाल करना है कंडम अगर पति तुमको बोलेगा मैं 500 रुपए देता हूं कंडम नहीं तो आप अपन उसको बोलना है कि मुझे पैसे की जरूरत नहीं मुझे 200 रुपए दे दे She is represented Indian transgenders abroad but says her work and the recognition she has got does not make up for the emptiness in her life. Now when I achieve everything and now I say I'm zero I don't have anything because we don't have parents I means I've seen the other hijras also they don't have parents and we miss them Off camera we really tried a lot to convince Gauri to meet her family after 18 long years we were really hoping to capture this reunion on camera but every time we mentioned her family Gauri just withdrew her confidence seemed to crumble she was just not ready to face them Maybe she feared the social implications the reunion might have on her family. I can sit with Obama, I can sit with Narendra Modi and talk about my gender identity, but I don't have guts to stand in front of my daddy and convey him that yes, this was my need and I have done this. The Supreme Court judgment has addressed the social ostracism faced by transgenders. instructing central and state governments to tackle the issue of social pressure of social stigma of fear and depression that transgenders face and to create public awareness to end their treatment as untouchables but transgender rights activists and lawyers fear that implementation will be slow well anywhere else in the world two and a half months would be enough time to implement in india two and a half years may not be enough time because the government is automatically lethargic some ask why transgenders have been classified as other backward castes or obcs there are also fears that in spite of the judgment government officials will remain insensitive towards transgender issues i don't think the bureaucrats who actually are shaping in any manner um, clued in to what needs to be done the principal secretary of the women and child department of the state of maharashtra when he met some of my colleagues yesterday was not even aware of the transgender judgment but the judgment has given the community hope they feel reservation in education and jobs now granted by law will create opportunities beyond sex work and begging society has made us a nuisance according to their own perspective because they don't want to take ownership It's easy to say they clap, they strip, they beg, they do sex work, they do badai. What the hell you have created for us? Nothing. Every night past midnight, this 30-year-old puts on her makeup, guzzles three to five bottles of beer before standing at this bus stop to solicit customers. ये लाइन ऐसे है अगर मुझे धंधे पे खड़ा है रस्ते पे खड़ा रहना चाहिए. तो मुझे शराब का सारा लेना पड़ता है क्योंकि बहुत सारे शराबें ऐसे आते हैं बे रुपये होगी सौ रुपये और ज़्यादा दूंगा तो बस आदत से इंसान मजबूर होता है सिगरेट पियोगे और सौ रुपये दूंगा तो पीते गई पीते गई पीते गई एवरी कस्टमर फैच इज हंड्रेड टू फाइव हंड्रेड रुपीज If someone demands unprotected sex without a condom, she may charge up to thousand rupees. The prevalence of HIV AIDS is common among transgender sex workers. A NACO survey found an 8% prevalence rate of HIV in the TG community in India. ऐसे छोटे लड़के मिल जाते थे कि जो कहते थे नहीं जी हमें तो इस्तेमाल करना ही नहीं है अब करेगी या तो पीटेगी. But as the sex worker in Delhi says, customers often force them to have unprotected sex. कई लोग तो बहुत बदतमीजी से भी बात करते हैं कि अब कर रही कि नहीं कर रही. ये गाड़ी से धक्का दे दूंगा प्लेट रखा प्लेट मार दूंगा मुंह पे सेक्स के लिए लेके जाते हैं वहाँ पे एक लेके जाते हैं होते चार जन हैं सेक्स करने के बाद पैसे भी छीन लेते फोन भी छीन लेते और मारते अलग कपड़े फाड़ के भगा देते आफ्टर ट्वेल्व ईयर्स ऑफ सेक्स वर्क थ्री ईयर्स गो सीमा फाउंड आउट दैट शी वॉज एच आई वी पॉजिटिव मरना तो आज भी और कल भी है इस जिंदगी से अच्छा छुटकारा तो मिलेगा ट्रांसजेंडर्स हुआ एच आई वी पॉजिटिव फेस अ डबल स्टिग्मा जब उनको ये पता चला था कि हमारा बेटा ऐसा निकल आया तो उन्होंने ऐसे व्यवहार करना चालू कर दिया जब पॉजिटिव का पता चलेगा तो शायद वो मुंह लगाना भी बंद कर देंगे 
वो शायद फोन उठाना भी बंद कर दें वो शायद बात करना भी बंद कर दें not just from their families and from society but also at healthcare facilities doctor log kai bar aisa hota hai ki वैसे टोक देते हैं कि तुम लाइन तोड़ के अंदर आ जाते हो ये है वो है तुम्हें जरा भी तमीज नहीं है तो मैं क्या मेरी हम, हमारी एक्स्ट्रा लाइन बना दो आप डॉक्टर्स डोंट इवन टच यू लाइक दैट दे डोंट इवन पुट योर टेलीस्कोप ओवर हियर रिसेंटली वन ऑफ माय केस हैज हैपेंड विद द गवर्नमेंट हॉस्पिटल केएम हॉस्पिटल वन ऑफ माय चेला शी इज टू वर्क विद अ हियर एज अ काउंसलर एंड सडनली शी वी टुक हर टू हॉस्पिटल देन द डॉक्टर केम and just write on the file if she is hiv positive you are bring here and you just throw two days my chelas was doing her cleaning and all she was kept at near to toilet she was raising for medicine she could not get proper care no doctor was looking at her in the morning 6 o'clock one of my chela called nani kumari is no more with us while the courts have been progressive society has a lot of catching up to do step 1 has to be the family <laughs> lakshmi's mother admits that when she discovered lakshmi's gender preference she was shaken thoda dukh hua phir apne man ko samjha sahi baat hai ye dusre log apne maa baap ko chhod chhod ke maa baap nikal diye वो बच्चे दर दर के ठोकर खाते हैं भीख मांगते हैं कोई भी माँ बाप को दुख होता है बट सून एम्ब्रेस्ड हर डिसीशन एंड रिमेन्स अ प्राउड मदर इवन टुडे। मेरी लड़की क्या बोली है मम्मी कितना हुआ तो तेरा औलाद है तेरे को छोड़ के नहीं कहीं जा रहा है कोई हिजड़ा इतना हुआ नहीं नामी गर्भ है गर्भ है, है। Lakshmi's support system is amazing. She lives with her mother, her brother, her sister-in-law and a little nephew. Her life story only defeats those with a closed mindset who may think that for a 5-year-old growing up amidst hijras, what is the kind of impact that it will have on this young mind? But what's more important is that that this child adores Lakshmi as much as Lakshmi adores the child. The normalcy in this family fills the house with positivity. It is a true recognition and victory of life. Cold lined eyes, lips painted a dark red and long flowing hair. For the third gender, physical appearance plays a very crucial role. The way they look is often a true reflection of what they actually feel within. My mind used to say that uh, I'm a girl but I have to shave. That pain Every day when you stand in front of the mirror you see you don't have a breast you have a chest hair on your body it was feeling the anger it was you know it was such a strong anger that what i have gotten because i don't need it i don't want to miss it was not useful for me i just wanted to be a woman but a complete physical sex change from a man to a woman is medically complex and expensive Sex realignment surgery or SRS can cost up to 3 lakh rupees. Breast implants another 1 lakh. Hair removal and hormone therapy a few thousand more. Most transgenders unable to afford this still choose the traditional route of castration. This 14-year-old boy stays with his parents but is convinced he wants to join the Hijra community. He says he's ready to get himself castrated. तैयार हूँ मैं ऑपरेशन के लिए. फिलहाल का अपना काट के ही घर पे रहना चाहता हूँ. फिर जब भी हिजड़े में जाना है मुझे तभी मैं इधर इंजेक्शन लगाऊँगा. जो लड़की के पास है वो मुझे वो सब कुछ चाहिए. For youngsters struggling with their sexual identity, psychological evaluation and counseling regarding sex change, even medical advice about the lengthy surgeries and medications involved is hardly ever available. It is not a reversible procedure. That's why WHO guideline worldwide we have to see 3 years counseling should be have to be necessary. Unaware and therefore unafraid of any complications. This boy wants to become a hijra physically but is scared of spelling this out to his mother. Kab bhi to tum bataogi? Ha, kab bhi to batanga. To fir aaj banne ke baad. Na kore chal. 
When his mother comes looking for him, we try to gently tell her about her child's need to change his gender. Surprisingly, she's accepting of her son's desire to be a girl. Very good. But is afraid of the social ridicule that he would face. What surprised me the most was how normally his mother reacted, while the child was terrified of telling his mother. Her only fear was, what will people say about my son? Will they make fun of him? The worry was for her child and not for herself. Maybe if we had more counselling centres that were easily accessible, it would help in more family and social acceptance of transgenders. These transgenders are part of a public awareness campaign on road safety. Their video in fact went viral on YouTube. While road safety is the primary message, there is also a subtler message about social acceptance. If you have a seatbelt, why don't you wear it? I'll teach you. We don't need to be scared. We're actually standing on the signal, we give money and give them a good word. Hey, naughty girl! While Anu and her team are actors who regularly get bit roles as hijras in films and television serials, begging at signals is a reality for most hijras. Begging is not easy, standing on a road. Well, noon, sun comes on your head. You have not eaten proper food and each and every car you are clapping and knocking the door for the single money. You just eat and you just give them money. Have any people ask them, chill chai peegi? Or just smile at them. They won't, might be they will just be happy. <laughs> Nisha and her friends are among the 9,000 hijras in India who beg for a living. Migrating from Andhra Pradesh to Mumbai eight years ago, they are educated and articulate, and yet have to beg at this traffic junction. The Supreme Court judgment has provided for job reservation for transgenders. But how will they claim those jobs and will they be accepted? I went to the office for a job purpose. So there, where, what will happen, I know. They can ab abuse, criticize, so that's why anyone cannot prefer the trying to job. It is also difficult for someone who is in this shell for a very long time, where the person do not want to come out just because has been you know, facing so much of stigma and discrimination, not seen as a human at all. It will take time this, for this person to understand. While older transgenders struggle to make the leap of faith and join mainstream society, the younger generation of hijras have faith in the new law. Nargis, formerly Shahbaz, is a hotel management student. She has embraced the hijra culture, is a disciple of a popular transgender guru, is even considering sex realignment surgery and isn't shy of revealing her identity or voicing her opinions in an open classroom. In terms of hospitality, hotel management, would that be a good thing for your institute or would, uh, how would that come across? Front office be a girl or a girl can be a girl. You can show a hotel in front of a girl and show a girl and show a girl and show a girl. This is my opinion. He's like a human being, so we cannot have a distinguish amongst the human being. If he becomes a hijra tomorrow, would you remain his friend? I would uh, like to be his, his friend in, even in future. So Shaba should not uh, be confused, he should follow his mind freely. Because India is growing and uh, people will exp uh, accept him as he is. Jaisa aaj logon ne mujhe accept kiya, waise aur jitne bhi gays hain, aur jitne bhi transgenders hain, aur jitne kuch aur das categories ke hain, unhe bhi aisa pyar mile, unhe bhi aisa izzat mile. A few positive baby steps are now being taken. Pune's Ferguson College is admitting transgenders with a TG option available on their application.
and yet the recognition remains partial. The Supreme Court's refusal to decriminalize gay sex under Section 377 baffles transgenders. How is their gender recognized but not their sexual preference? 377 judgment, which was a narrow viewpoint on sexuality rights, the most conservative, archaic, obsolete, offensive view on sexuality rights. And India is a young country. Beggars could not be choosers. At the point when this verdict came, did we have a choice? Out of nothing, we had something, something landmark judgment. Today, the law of the land has recognized transgenders and given them the identity and dignity they deserve. But recognition is far from complete. To make them feel loved and feel accepted as a part of our society is up to each one of us. The stumbling block to the final embrace remains in our minds. I want the coming generation to have education, to be as normal as anything, to be an anchor, to be a camera person, to be a doctor, to be a sweeper, to be a police person, to work, serve the Indian army. I want everything so normal. Why can't?